And we're a company where we don't make excuses, we provide solutions. And so finding a partner like Matthews, where we actually have somebody that's providing solutions, it was an easy, easy decision because we had never seen anything like that. If you look at what makes Estaframe successful, it's information. So, you know, we're selling this big giant 60 foot saw and what sells it is that print head, right? That's that's the key, that's the secret sauce for Estaframe. Putting the information on the material so that the customer understands how that gets built. But the Easy Frame, it's a marking machine first. So we wanna be the best at marking and always stay on top of new developments. Our goal is that it needs to be reliable and print well, print after print after print. Prior to using the Matthews technology, we were spending a lot of time going out back out into the field and dealing with problems that were all pointing back to the printer. And sometimes we'd have failures with the equipment failing right out of the box. So when we got our first Matthews system, we had the first demo unit up and running in the first day. We got our first unit and it was the print head with the bottle t attached directly to the print head, and that's it. And then a controller. Very streamlined, very sensible. It's an amazing print controller. And to my surprise, it was an XML-based language, which I thought was, wow, this is, this is amazing. What we really liked about it was the fact that you can literally manipulate the XML on the controller itself. We were really, really impressed. As a product manager, the main thing I'm looking at is how often are we having to support the technology and, and how much of a drain is it on us and the customer to support. Uh, once we implemented the Matthews, we literally haven't had a system fail in the two years that we've been running them now. Another advantage that we found with the Matthews is the ink. We didn't think that the ink could make such a difference. But the Matthews ink is, is quite a bit better than the inks we had used in the past as well. Hi, my name is Oscar Geary, and I'm the production manager here at RJP Framing. Basically, what RJP Framing does, we create these prefabricated walls to send out to the job site, so all they have to do out there is just stand up the walls. But yeah, no, working with Easy Frame, it's, it's been nice. And now the machine's a great machine. It's very well made. Printer's really, really good. It's very, very clear, very accurate, very durable as well. There's never been a case where the markings came off either by accident or intentionally. We've actually tested the markings by uh, printing on a piece of lumber and trying to wash it off immediately, and they, they don't come off. There's also been a case where uh, we have a job that got pushed out. Uh, it's got pushed out like about six months. The lumber aged due to the sun and the weather, but the markings still stayed on the plate. You know, so that was pretty cool to see. Our very first printer that we had, I went and talked to all the operators. I said, how much time you spent during your shift to maintain this and keep your print consistent? Multiple operators said about an hour and a half every eight hour shift. That was enormous amount of time in my mind. I figured if it was over 10 minutes, there was something wrong. We then moved to Matthew Systems. I have a guy right now, he said he's gone two months with never doing a clean cycle, never even taking a swab to it. He's never touched it. And he's gone through an entire bottle of ink and it just has worked perfectly the entire time. You can't even do that with a home printer, especially running it eight, 10, 12 hours a day. I feel like we have something that's a true solution. I would always back a Matthews printer. Since we got the Matthews system for the first time in 12 years, I feel bulletproof with the marking. I love the support and the service and the friendships that I have with the Matthews team. Without Matthews, we would not be where we're at. That's a fact.